welcome back to my channel. So today I wanted to create this look for you guys. This look was inspired by Leo since it is currently Leo season. This is part of my horoscope zodiac birth sign series here on my channel. I will link the other videos in the series down below so you guys can go check them out. And while you're checking out those videos, you might as well subscribe to my channel. Subscribing is 100% free, just letting you know. So go ahead and click that subscribe button. The symbol for Leo is of course the lion, so that's where I grabbed my inspiration from. The lashes were giving me so much trouble today, they just did not want to go on. But other than that, this was a really fun look to do and I love this like, fieriness, I love it. So if you guys are interested in learning how to get this look, then just keep on watching. Okay, so first I'm going to start off with the brows. I'm going to fill them in using these four bottom shades from my Alamar Reina del Caribe palette to create a reddish brown shade. Next, I'm going to go ahead and prime my face with this Dr. Brandt Pores No More Luminizing Primer. And here, I don't know why I didn't show you guys, but I'm just cleaning up my brows and priming my lids with the Tarte Shape Tape Concealer in Light Medium Honey. And then I'm just going to set that down with the Wet n Wild Single Shadow in Creme Brulee. Then going back into the Alamod palette, I'm taking this beautiful golden yellow matte shade called Coco Taxi and I'm applying it to the inner half of my top lid all the way up to the crease and the inner half of my bottom lash line as well. Now you can skip this step if you have a true red eyeshadow, but since I didn't, I went in with this NYX Vivid Brights Cream Color in Cyber Pop as a base. And I applied it on the outer corner all the way up to the crease and on the bottom lash line as well. Then on top of that, I applied the shade Tropico. And then I went back in with the shade Guantanamera to deepen the outer corners as well as the outer bottom lash line to connect the top to the bottom. Now I'm taking a clean brush and really blending out the edges to create a seamless finish. To highlight my inner corners and brow bone, I'm mixing together the Ofra highlighters in Rodeo Drive and You Do You. Next, I'm creating a wing using the NYX Vivid Brights Liquid Liner in Vivid Halo. Now, I'm just curling my lashes and applying some of this Butter London Double Decker Mascara. For my waterline and tightline, I'm going in with this dark brown pencil from Jante Bleu. Moving on to the face, I'm going to mix together my Milani Conceal and Perfect Foundation in the shade Warm Beige with my Becca Liquid Shimmering Skin Perfector in Prosecco Pop. And when applying foundation, I always go in with a brush first for maximum coverage and then I go back in with a beauty sponge to get rid of any brush strokes. For concealer, I'm of course going back in with my Tarte Shape Tape and I'm going to set that down with this Ofra Cosmetics Banana Powder. To set down the rest of my face, I'm using this Physicians Formula Argan Wear Bronzer in Light Bronzer. Then to contour my face, I'm using these two shades from the Pure Sculptor Palette. And here I'm using some more of that Banana Powder to clean up my contour a little bit. For some extra glow, I'm going to use this Wet n Wild Rose Golden Goddess Shimmer Palette as a glowy bronzer. Then for blush, I'm going in with this Milani Baked Blush in Rose de Oro. To highlight my face, I'm going back in with Ofra's Rodeo Drive and You Do You Highlights. Then I'm just popping on some lashes. These ones are from e.l.f. This was near impossible to do, but I finally got them on. For the lips, I'm going in with this ColourPop Ultra Matte Lip in Mama. Literally the most beautiful red-orange liquid lipstick shade ever. And finally, I'm just going to set down my face with this Mario Badescu Facial Spray. Alright guys, so that's it for this makeup tutorial. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!